Are you guys experiencing high VRAM usage like this and don't want to have to change your graphics settings just to get below that max line? Well, I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now with one very easy trick. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm just on the game here, just want to show you guys proof that my line is above the max thing. You can see that it's red. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and quit out of the game. That's right. You don't have to change anything on the game when you're doing this method. So we're going to quit out of the game. Once you've quit out the game, go into your file explorer, go into documents, and then go down to your Call of Duty folder. Double click on that, go into players, and then you wanna open this one here that says options.free.quad22. Double click on that and make sure you open it in Notepad. We're gonna scroll all the way down to the bottom and you wanna find this setting here, the one that says set a target fraction of your PC's video memory to be used by the game. This is your VRAM. So the value we are changing is this one here. So you can see that this is the minimum and this is the maximum. Do not go above 2.0 but find one that fits nicely to your computer. Everyone's computer is obviously different because we all have different graphics cards and different components. For me, I found a, a value that works really well is 1.45. So you can see I've just input that 1.45. Again, try different values for yourself or even just try 1.45. Maybe that'll work great for you as well. So once you've input the value that you want, go ahead, file, save, and that is it. We're gonna close that. And I'm going to go ahead and open up Call of Duty again and show you guys that the VRAM will now be below the max line and your game should run so much smoother. Okay, so we're back on Model Warfare 2 and we're going to go ahead into settings, go back into graphics, and there you go. You can now see that my VRAM usage is easily below that um, max line. It's no longer red. And as I said, you can go higher than 1.45, just see what fits you best. You can even go to 2 if you want to max out your VRAM usage. But yeah, that is one simple trick you can use without having to change any of the graphic settings. This should help you with FPS drops and all those things that just make the game not feel so smooth. If you guys did find this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on bell notifications because I upload content just like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.